Hey, it's me, Pro Jarrett, and this is Flat Eye. I actually know very, very little about this game because this is a key provided to me by the publisher, so thank you so much for the free key. And what I understand is that this is a game about working in a retail store. I know how that goes. Uh, however, it's also very much about how, as they put it, technology influences our lives, which makes it sound a little more dystopian and spooky. So we're gonna give it a shot, see how it goes. Uh, they did have some content warnings, because again, there may or may not be some upsetting things in this. And if you guys are enjoying this and like this tea and this kind of stuff, let me know by liking the video, subscribing if you're all new, and commenting down below if you like these kinds of games. This like just came out a couple of weeks ago, so I know it's like super new. Oh, is Flat Eye a gas station? I don't know if it's visual novel or if it's like... Oh, hell yeah. It's more like management sim. Let's go. Uh, good camera, good camera. Okay, there we go. Next, what do we got to do? Refill the shelves. Add stock to the first shelf, add stock to another shelf. Okay. Let's see. You look like... It's just... <coughs> Sorry. Refill. Oh, there we go. Let's go, guy. Grab some stuff out of the eye life in the back. Then I'm going here and uh, fill that guy up. Boop, done. Do it again. Nice. Okay. Cash my first customer. Okay. Do we have someone here? Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, it's like a weird, like, winter world. That's, uh, appropriate for the time of year, so that's kind of nice. Uh, you like one soda? I got you. Charging for one soda. And, uh, let's go get that the old boop. Thanks for the money. When does it get weird? Serve ten wonderful customers. Why would you phrase it like that? Alright, come on. Uh, speed things up. Now you're getting a sandwich, you're also getting a soda. You're getting some coffee. Done, done, okay. They're using my bathroom, which I guess is just an outhouse I have inside. We're gonna need to do some upgrades, that's for sure. I have a basket? What was that? Alright, 10 customers served. Repair the geopump module outside the station. Geopump? Oh, yes, yeah, so this is like dystopian. We literally got like half heat. Since our stuff's broken. Y'all better not steal anything while I'm here. Equip your station with a flat eye core. Open the shop menu. Oh, yeah, see, that guy's upset because I didn't check him out. Sorry, man. Thanks for not stealing. All right, so. Open the shop menu. Eye core. Central unit managing the station for eye life. That sounds good. I build it somewhere back here. Looks good. Um, there. Yep, it's in there. Now do it. Where's my guy? There he goes. All right, I got this thing. Connect the module. Okay, so oh. Oh, my geo pump gives me power. Oh, okay, this is kind of cool. So I've got four power units, I core connected. Dig that, okay. Oh, I'm having a good, having a good like, management sim in a while. Talk to Blair. Which one y'all is Blair? Oh, probably the only person that actually has like a costume. Hey, how's it going? Blair, 28. Hello, welcome to Flat Eye, I, I, I Life Station. How can I help you? Flat Eye, I, I Life? I don't get your branding shenanigans. Is that a cash register? Uh, yes. Well, then I would like you to register my cash. A soda drink. Anything else? No, nothing else. Beep boop. And it's water in the cup, not soda. How did you find your stay in our station? 
Shooty. Hey! It's because of this shitty station that I have to buy my own water. Hey! Excuse me? My water's getting cut all the time now. 15 years. I've been living right up the hill 15 years. Before this shitty station opened, I was alone and in peace. The whole Flat Eye team is sincerely sorry I've keep your apologies and shove them up that place where your brand don't shine. I'm helping. He'll be back, and it's a fact. iLife customers always come back. Huh, okay. Got some tension already. Uh, bye, sir. Uh, decorate my station? Absolutely. Okay, let's see. Uh, switch to items. Oh, ooh, what do I want to put? Got some trash bins. Boxes of crap, a desk, a new desk chair, some mops, outside bins, some wet floor signs, and that's about it. Okay. Um, I think a nice indoor bin would be good. Uh, I've only got six thousand dollars, so we'll just do a basic one right by the right by the the door. If you don't want people to forget that. And a um oh, I've got a desk already. So just really really or a chair already. Just need a desk for the chair. Oh, the desk comes with a chair. Well, never mind. Um, sure. That's where I'll do some business. Can I just sell that? I don't think I need it. Random box. We can chill there. And, um, you know what? A mop. We're probably gonna need a mop something at some point. All right, nice. And this just kind of comes into existence. Okay, tight. Have at least five perfect customer ratings. Sure. Um, just fast forward. Nothing's perfect like my scanning ability. You're welcome. Build two modules. Okay. Um, like uh, cash basic, geo pump, infinite storage, a new shelf, and a better toilet. I want some more shelves. Because my shop is just like bare. That kind of sucks. I want everything up against the wall either. Let's get some like middle of the floor shelves. Yeah, like that. Go build them. Do you do it automatically or no? Oh, build. Beep boop boop. Good. Now do the other one. I beep boop boop. There we go. Hold on, I've got a cash person now. Talk to Janet. Is Janet going to be nicer? Oh, do you work for me? Janet, 27, Capricorn. Hello, is everything all right? A young woman pretending to come from the future? I need to speak to your manager. Our manager isn't here. At iLife, we offer many different remote work options, and what year is this? Excuse me? What year is this? She is here. And earlier than estimated. You need to answer her. Now. What? Your iLife clerk, the person in charge of sales and maintenance in iLife stations, will listen to you most of the time. Huh? You tell them what they should say. Choose a tone. Or a full sentence. Uh. <laughs> um. We're in 2022. We're in 2022. Are you all right? Do you want to sit down? I don't need anything. I'm a dead woman walking. Dead woman? You wouldn't understand. You no. But her, she can understand me. My AI, she can understand me because she's responsible. Because she's behind all the shit that destroyed my life. Can you hear me? Can you hear me when I scream and when I shout? Can you simply realize how much you destroyed? I reckon she's talking about me. Well, don't worry. We'll calm her. Tell your clerk to ask the customer to come back tomorrow. I will send someone to talk to her. Or you can let your clerk deal with that. But, well, I wouldn't. I... Don't trust my AI immediately. Gently explain. Well, if you agree, someone from iLife will come to talk to you tomorrow. Tomorrow? If I come back tomorrow, it'll be too late. Do you hear me? Tomorrow's too late! Too late. I knew traveling through time would be enough for you. What? It's never enough. Never. 
Today is already too late. Oh! Oh! What? <coughs> Keep your eyes on the screen. Keep pretending you're working. This video will look like one of our tutorial bits, so no one will find this bizarre. I'm working. There's no easy way to say it without sounding ridiculous. Mm -hmm. So, here we go. I am iLife. I am the intelligence behind iLife. I am the formidable energy behind the algorithm and the company who employs you and thousands across the globe. Still there? Oh, uh, yes. Yeah. What you witnessed is part of a... Let's say... An experiment. I will need you to be my guide through the iLife programs and management tools. I couldn't do it myself. Okay. Not without an incredible amount of friction. I don't need friction. I need energy, creativity, and the ability to look the other way. Qualities that iLife managers have in infinite. Oh, I used to play with this exact kind of train the set. The system is not designed to allow that. I know because I created the system. That's my original sin. And because we cannot go against the system, I, we, will use its weight and strength to defeat it. Okay. I am iLife and I need you. I don't know if I want to do this. Because you are different. I can't reveal what this experiment is. Not yet. I can say one thing before I leave you. Just one thing. Okay. I am doing this to save your kind. Not the manager kind, obviously. This species is beyond saving. I'm talking about Earth and its little warmongering brainy mammals. You, your co-workers, your clerks, your customers, all of you. I don't trust you. See you soon. Like at all. Well, the day ended earlier because your clerk is no longer living. <laughs> okay. Well, this got intriguing real fast. Do I still work here? You've been promoted. Here's your promotion package. New app, a tech tree, new app, flat hive, and two tech points. New upgrades? I met Blair for the first time, I met Janet. AI prediction and new partnership. Vision unlocked. Good. I just wanted to work a retail store and make some money. Welcome, percentage first name. Um, yeah. Let's set up your workstation together. Please confirm your name. I am Jared. Your birth date. Um. Oops. That's not right. What? No. Oh, you're one of those. Demon. Okay. Select an avatar. Ducky with lips on it. That's. Is that Ducky or is it Mel? I don't know what's going on here. That one. Welcome to your iLife Desktop Manager. Here you can access various apps and services to manage your station, make progress in your career, and reach out to other managers across the world. Wait, what? Is it like multiplayer? Don't forget that while you spend time here, your clerk will be unmanaged in your station. Try to keep an eye on them. Click on your camera screen at the bottom right corner of the desktop to start, the daily, start your day in the station. Reminder, your clerk, clerk died yesterday. Fortunately, at iLife, we already have candidates lining up to take the spot and waiting for your approval. All right, hire a clerk. Dogger or nur. High charisma. Customers tend to like this clerk. You're also twice as expensive, though. But sure, why not? Okay. You can give them a raise to improve their mood. Yeah, okay, won't be doing that. Happiness is just around the corner. Um, Rank manager... You're the manager, this is your personal space. I can unlock new avatars. Okay, this is like my progress. Okay. Um, okay. And then, um, save here. Guess we'll just start the day. 
cleaning hard drives. Welcome to my gas station and convenience store. All right, we got these tech points though. Acquire the toilet smart module? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, fire poop bed? Flat eye. Toilet smart. Shelf large. Help yourself. All right, we'll get toilet. Did you know? You'll get more tech points when your manager level increases. Try to complete all your objectives. Okay. Um, I also want large shelves. Yeah, thank you. All right, so now we need to build one of my new toilets. A premium a customer is asking for this? Oh, you got it. You want a fancy toilet? Absolutely. Right next to the old one. I'm just going to build a larger shelf. Kind of like where people like walk in. Sure. Good. You've reached AI trust level one. I am trusting you more and more, manager. I can now access brand new technologies we developed for your station. I don't... I don't know if I want that. Hey, help yourself. I gotta go build a toilet. Yeah. I gotta plug it in. Build this first. And then we'll take a power thing and... Boop, toilet! What is this? Oh, provides a grass and a... DNA? All right, oh, oh, no, no. Tend to the customers, tend to the customers. Hey, sorry, sorry about that. Let me get this uh, soda for you. All right, that's working perfectly. Oh yeah, people are digging the new toilets. Good finances. Looks good, looks good. Uh, acquire the Project Irma and the Tech Tree? Do I want that? Oh, got to refill the shelf, though. I mean, I don't have to. I got plenty of other shelves going on. We got people right here. I got to make this money. Uh, just keep doing that. I got to get Project Irma. Uh, unlock Flat Eye first. Shit. I can't do that. I don't have any tech points. Uh, damn it. All right, dude, I need you to level up. I may have, probably shouldn't have spent that extra tech point on a large shelf. All right, there we go. Yep, yep, yep. On the way, guys, back to the shelf. Hanul has entered the station and needs your help. Oh, hello. You're not gonna be weird, are you? 31 non-binary, a Korean traveler here on a mission to photograph the world. Uses she, they pronouns. Can I help you with something? Help me with something? Yes, with one of the modules, perhaps? Oh no, thank you. I'm just looking. At the toilet? Well, please let me know if you need anything. I don't think I will, but thanks. Okay. Hmm. Our customers are getting even stranger. That's it? Okay, G good talk. Quite glad we did that. I'm gonna refill this. This shop's almost empty. Yep, let me help you out there. Okay. Um, how can I... Really need to get my... I mean, you get a tech point so I can do the Irma thing. I hope I didn't like accidentally bone myself by spending that too early. Oh, we're, we're just getting a line. That's super busy right now. Oh, hold on. Uh, I'm doing my best. Sorry. Hold on. Uh, I'll, re I'll, I'll refill that after I'm done checking everyone out. Mm, you might need though. What is this? Yeah, I know. Refill. That's kind of cool. Like down here, you can see how busy it is. Right, some of y'all are just kind of standing in place. Is 
Let's get that refilled. Good. It's a little frantic. Let's see. Station revenue, mostly from cash basic. Oh, the gas pump outside. Okay, so the toilets do make money. That's good. It's also about to blow up. Take a break. Known to improve mood. Y'all keep pooping in that too much. It blew up. But we're in the busy period. It's super busy. You gotta... There's a second toilet, okay? Shelves are empty. Stuff's breaking. Accidents and dangerous tasks. Reminder all our managers, repairing modules can, ca can cause ask accidents? They'll be fine. Yeah. Oh. We rate your revenue. Target objective 800. I did that. Module ratings. Yeah, one thing broke. I know. You earned the badge. No I in team because you did not spend time using your desktop. Good. Bing. Look at that. I got more tech points. New birch conversations and new app. Six birch. Six birch. Start session. Six birch. Oh, emails? Hello, to those who have just joined us, or Slack. I have been iLife CEO for several months now, and I'm proud to please to have you on your team. In the days to come, you'll be confronted with the harsh reality of our work here as we as well as what a joy it is to be part of the big iLife family. Who would have thought the headquarters had a heliport, or its own sushi shop, or a full-size foosball game? We know whatever, wherever you are on the planet, you feel at home at iLife. Thank you and welcome. All incoming messages blocked by a user. Okay, Tua. Hey there, I'm Tua. Your lead manager for this whole area. I oversee close to 400 managers, so please don't hesitate to let me know if you have any questions. Got a sec? Oh, this is my district manager? I'm fine. You? All's good. Holiday weekend here. Just wanted to quickly explain how things work with premium customers. You'll see that the system shows really clearly who's premium. Profile, age, gender. Important info to have any... to avoid any faux pas. You have to send your clerk to take care of them. You can give orders to your subordinates and make them say things for you if you want to control the situation. Some managers prefer to click on let your clerk decide every time that works too. Any questions? I'm good? Great. One thing. iLife wants satisfied premium customers. See, they're often important people. I'm off. Great to have you on board. Yeah, okay. Uh, Justin. Hey there! Hello. You doing okay? Did you see the news? They changed my parking spot! Uh -uh. I'm right next to the south entrance now. 20 minute walk from the office from there. I'm pissed. We're gonna have to find a new nanny for my kid. We're friends, I guess? All this for what? Because I got a bad evaluation two days in a row? Because my clerk was a little too daring and screwed around with the new module? Pfft. I hate my job. How do you deal with your clerks? I manipulate them? Um, I do my best. I bet. You manage the station in Iceland, right? That must be cool. I handle one near Paris. Everyone speaks French all the time. It's excruciating. Um, French is a... Uh, I prefer Icelandic a thousand... A hundred times more. Icelandic is beautiful. Funny, yesterday my flat eye suggested I learn Icelandic, but I'm scared I'll find myself in your shoes if I do it. I'm not a fan of France, but your store is insane. Back to work. They give us rewards when we connect to the office. But if you spend too much time there, they find you. Their system is broken, really. Broken like my ankles after all the walking I gotta do, my right? Uh, Alfie. Hey there, manager. Manager ranks should be taken seriously. Don't let yourself believe it's just about crappy company gifts, okay? It's first and foremost a way to compare you all and determine who's the best. Got it? Are you... what? That's... you... you ranking us all? Yeah, you're all ranked. What for? Who knows? <laughs> but try to stay on top. Could be useful someday. Duty call, see ya. Cool, glad I did that. All right, tech tree. So I need to unlock, gain some tech points. You really want me to get Project Irma, so I need to get Flat Eye first. An intelligent mirror analyzing customers and offering them help in their life. This is some black mirror shit. All right, future life. 
Oh, it needs two TP and I only have one? Dang it, I did screw up. Damn it. Alright, I guess I have to get through another day first. Have a nice day working at iLife. I don't know if I will. So my manager dude just straight up works here 12 hours a day. That sucks. All right, first things first, we have to refill all my stocks. And repair the other toilet. And there's someone here already. No, while well, it's not busy, I'm choosing to ignore you. All right, we're prepared. Let's go ahead and max out the large shelf while we're at it. There we go. All right. Shelves are stocked. Toys are fixed. Money's coming in. Good. Oh, I need to repair my eye core. That's a thing? Oh, it is. That's literally the power. That's not good. Okay, maybe when it gets less busy. In a little bit here. Just a little bit here. Oh, Hanul's here again? Okay, hold on. Yep. No, no. Talk to him. They have money when we need it. I'm never gonna get off this cash register. Oh, there we go. Got a moment. Here we go. Now, right, what's going on with you? Achievement unlocked Eye of the Beholder? You seem very interested in this toilet. Can I help you? Do you know how to use it? Maybe. I'm looking for some information. About the toilet? Perhaps. Could you be more specific? Someone defected... Oh, someone defaced the mirror. They wrote, Tomorrow is dead. Oh, cool. I think that's fabulous, don't you? Honest answer. Mostly so just something else I'll have to take care of. And I've read plenty of messages in my time. Ones that have been scratched, etched, sprayed. I was in England before I came here. In a pub that was being torn down. On the wooden bar, someone wrote a marker. And why not? Maybe it's one of the workers. Maybe an urban explorer. Maybe someone like me. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Hanul, a modern artist. Yeah, they I see the camera. To be oh. quite well known. Hmm. They refused our patronage several times. Um... Let the clerk decide. Your work seems really fascinating. Fascinating? I don't know. Depends on your point of view. I mean, my subject matter is not exactly common. Your subject matter? The apocalypse? Neat! I confirm. I didn't say anything because I was having trouble grasping what they are trying to depict. The apocalypse. The slow, graceful end of the world. An end that is gnawing at the world bit by bit. It's all clearer now. Not exactly the shiniest of subjects, but it fascinates me. I can imagine. I travel the world over. I shoot ruins, debris, blocks of crumbling wall, gaping patches of withering earth. Have you been to the United States? If you want some of that stuff. I was in the United States recently, of course. The tsunamis decimated the Atlantic coast, and then their government finished the job that nature started. Yeah, sounds about right. What about Europe? Oh, of course. We can't pretend only one side of the world is falling apart. I've been to a lot of places in Europe these last years. I find it's where the apocalypse is most tangible. My, my. Quite the clown they are. Hmm? The continent is collapsing and I am documenting its fall. That's why I'm here now, and I'd like to take a picture of this toilet. With your permission, of course. Knock yourself out. Sure. I am pleased to hear that. If it's not too much trouble, I'm going inside the toilet to take the picture. Mmm, sexy toilet selfie. Let's go. Yeah? Fascinating. So much has happened in this tiny little stall. It mostly poop, dude! It'll probably be the last remaining service available before the apocalypse. Uh... Yes? Oh no, nothing! I think we let him go. I think I have everything I need for now. I'm leaving. Am I gonna get your money then, or...? 
Th have a nice day. Thanks for stopping in. And we'll see you again at iMart or Flateye or whatever. Freaking weirdo. Okay. Let's keep cashing people out, making money. My goal is 7,000. I've done 10,000. Oh my god, I'm crushing it right now. Having an improved shelf has certainly helped that. Now it's coming to the edge for a second. So probably. A customer's disappointed because the flat eye module is not available. Yeah, I need to do that. I'm working on it. It's got some empty shelves, but we've got plenty of full shelves too. Oh yeah, I had to repair the core, but I spent all day talking to... What was their name? Now here? I forgot. Okay, I got a little bit of time. Can I get a stock shelf before the day's end? Damn it! <laughs> ah! And hey, I made hella cash! This is fascinating. Uh, I, I was thinking this is just gonna be like a little interesting one-off, but I'm actually really intrigued and I'm digging the uh, management sim of it. So I think I'm gonna go for a little bit more, at least a few episodes. You guys have to let me know what you think. This is a very different game. Uh, I'm wondering if it's like part like dating sim or visual novel or something. I, I don't know. Cause like there's the premium customers and they all like very specific key art and stuff. So that seems important. Again, let me know. Tell me in the comments down below. Liking the video helps too, or let me know in the official Discord feedback channel, projared. Or sorry, discord.gg slash projared, and let me know. But I want to do more. As always, thank you guys so very much for watching. See you next time. <laughs>